Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. A very good evening to us in this video. Uh, so, uh, few days I think we have started to cover about many penny stocks and good stocks, uh, uh, or rather you can say many small caps and mid caps which could have a great potential. So one of such stock uh, which uh, struck me when I was doing some research work, one of his fiber of India that we already posted a video yesterday. Today it is about Compucom uh, Software Limited. So one of the key factors uh, that made me to speak about this company is the first and foremost thing is the consistency. Uh, what is the consistency we ask you friends? The company is uh, I think for a period of around 12 to 15 years continuously they are paying dividend also according to my knowledge. Maybe it could be greater than 15 years also. So paying of dividend is the first thing this company is going to do. So the dividend is ranging between 10 paise to 40 paise. Now you could argue with me that is a dividend if you ask your friends. This kind of dividend is percentage after you are coming over through two bonus issues, one split issue. Okay. So if you compare uh, the March lows, I think the March low was around 3 rupees also. And the company declared a dividend of around uh, 30 paise. So which means around 10% to the return of the dividend deal you are getting. Now let us leave these stocks away. And now let us focus on the business area what the company is doing. Okay. So I think uh, seeing the name software, I think many people will think that the company is doing software business. Yes, really the comp company is doing software business. But, but if the company is doing only software business, that does not make it to be a value pick. That is just a growth pick. A value pick or a multi pick is that what is the niche you are getting or what is the specialty that differentiates you from other companies okay and basically based upon a Rajasthan Jaipur segment this company is doing really wonders man I think uh, the business that is carried on is going to be superb okay now let me explain the various business factors so friends I think this segment is really very very the important segment I think uh, continuously if you can listen to me for one minute you could get to know what are the business company they are doing so first is IT software development both in India as well as in USA they are having a company called Indian Incorporation so they are doing business there second thing is that they are providing this uh, educational technology software so educational technology development to many government schools and third is they are providing information technology services to government uh, so e-government things they are doing so they could get an order for it and maintenance order for it that is the first core business apart from it now only the main thing is starting apart from which the company is generating wind energy okay and the fourth thing or the fifth thing the company is doing they have cold chain facility and the sixth thing the company is doing they are going to foring into food processing segments and the sixth thing they are company saying they are having two satellite TVs and the seventh thing the one and only important thing I think in Jaipur they are building a four star hotel okay now you could argue with me with such kind of things happening in the market why did not the share price rising that is the main thing why i am here to speak about this company with you now you could argue with me one of the key points you are saying all the things in oral but where is the proof for it now i request kindly request my friends whether you don't in, I mean whether you invest or whether you don't invest in this company I request my friends to go and check this annual report of this company. Okay, I think this is uh, from this company as you can see here. So, Compucom uh, software, this is uh, their thing. So, what they are trying to say is that uh, we are elaborating in IT and IETS and the first three quarters has been damaged due to this thing. But they are going to, they are trying to say is that our progress towards the venturing into hotel and hospital sector is pretty good. The construction work of our four star heritage hotel has been completed. Our team is working closely with the world class brands. So actually I think the cost of this hotel is around 25 to 30 crores. So half of it they had taken loan from SBA. I think if you go inside and see it right you could be able to know it. So which means basically the company is venturing into various fields but they are carefully operating. Just starting or going good. They are not what to say, they are not just like jumping it going on a massive scale. I think they are following the correct scale. If they are going to make sure and they are going to do this going to be correctly, I think they are going to make sure 
the company can be able to withstand and sustain it and make a very very good return in the future and now you are asking me whether there is a wind power things and whether there is that power things i think i am here to show you that okay uh, so let us see uh, what the company is going to do here and uh, one more thing is that uh, what else the company is doing right now so i am think i really searching for that okay and this is a board report the company is saying yes one of the key things what we are analyzing here is that the company is solidly earning around uh, 5 crores net profit after tax okay net profit after tax yes this time they have incurred a profit of just 1 crore but understand one thing the company before all the solution things the company is posting 17 crores of operating profit but due to this uh, depreciation that is the main main problem for this company depreciation is taking over for says even though that is what is a, a non cash item in the financial statement but due to that there is a huge huge uh, what is a uh, uh, reduction in profit if you consider one thing the total finance cost is coming to the range of around 2 crore but depreciation is 9 crore and that is what the it makes a main difficult for this thing so okay and as i said what are the segments of this company so software and e governance it is the first thing that i have said with you and also you should know they have uh, got some orders so which been for basically for 5 years they have get an order of around 6 crore so starting from december 2019 so which means basically they having they are getting orders from each and every segment and the company is having learning solutions and i said wind power energy wind power generation treasury activities and this is i think is very, very important thing and as i said to you right okay as you can see here the company is mainly operating multimedia content development education tv segments and education. the company has two channels one is jan tv and another is jan tv plus i think these are the how to say they are making it man i think they are creating it they are making it they are developing it but all are in a small to medium size scale yes i think at this level at this condition at this management so how were you thought that this management could make sure they could develop in the great future the consistency in paying dividend and the message to shareholders from the chairman i think we must appreciate uh, even though after the price damage right the management is trying to convince or the manager is trying to speak up what is they trying to say and, and and one more thing friends i think i cannot be able to attach this clip right now but i think i could be able to attach this clip in future the company management said that i think yes i am <clears throat> the company ceo said that seeing the this things the company is expecting a pact of around 20 crores per year so basically now they are posting 5 crores of profit so they are expecting 20 crores of profit this is and this is going to be a very very important turn around point for this company i think yesterday we discussed about fiber of india limited today we are discuss, discussing about compucom i mean software limited this type of companies yes i am accepting but i think this kind of investment will take long time maybe 2 or 3 years but i think instead of waiting i mean instead of uh, what to say uh, thinking that it would take a long time to get the return one friends or one of those who are going to make at least some investment should think that you're getting this many time of opportunities so that you would you could able to invest into a large level okay and uh, <clears throat> this is a dividend paid as i said you right from 2000 2001 the company is continuously paying dividend to 2020 so which means for paid for 20 years the company is paying dividend i said i think troll of the news i don't know correctly but seeing the annual reports you can see here the company is paying a dividend up to the period of around 20 years so that is really a very important key point that you should note and i already said the company is having a phase value reduction the bonus shares in the ratio 1 is to 1 and the 1 is to 2 ratio so which means basically this company is trying to make it possible and i believe it if this going to be continue and if this company going to make sure that they could be able to continue this kind of performance in the future then why could not the share price rise now let us come to the reality okay now friends you will ask me what if all the projects failed okay what if the new hotel they are building does not go pretty well what if the coal chain i think this is a important point the coal chain development under something i think the virus uh, vaccine if they going to get some pips are right i think the storage they want to call coal storage unit and basically not that coal storage unit is used for many purpose so which basically means 
it's going to be very important for this company i think i request my friends who are going to invest in this company or at least who are going to do some research work kindly read their annual report because i think i mean instead i mean i have read this so i have got some many more information so i request my friends those who are keen to do some research work in minishas if you're going to read these things i think you could be able to clearly understand what the company is trying to do with the management and with this people right and this is going to be a very important thing and as you can see this is the final talk i'm going to speak about the company is already in e governance project like itc education software design development uh, electronic media it media training and wind power generation pipeline for the center way in hospitality sector food processing cold chain and commodity trading sector and i discussed with you friends this is the how to say the basic reality but you know the market cap right now the market cap is 61 crore and also one more thing you should note the company book value is 16 rupees now i come to the first point what if all the future things that the hotel the processing things the cold chain all failed okay let us assume a state so which means basically the book value would remain then because for a period of 5 years they have a contract with the uh, it segment so which basically means as a continuous source of dividend the continuous source of investment the continuous source of revenue for this company these are the new net additions which could develop the company to great level so think carefully and decide carefully what i want to do i think they have taken this effort for my friend so that he could help you able to help you then kindly help me by sharing this video to your friends so that also click the subscribe button friends okay thank you welcome